Trump fans rioting in the Capitol building get pre-sentencing detention. But liberals rioting in the Tennessee Capitol building get the red carpet treatment. Not, not only did the so-called Tennessee Three score invites to the White House, but this morning they were featured guests on Good Morning America. Yet another example of why corporate media is the enemy of Republicans. Here now is Representative Gloria Johnson commemorating the moment. Do these look like the faces of victims? Six people, including three kids, were murdered, and these people are cheerfully cashing in. But it all worked. Justin Jones, one of the expelled members, was reinstated earlier this evening, on a temporary basis at least, by the Nashville City Council. Here was his gracious response. Today we're sending a resounding message that democracy will not be killed in the comfort of silence. Secondly, we are calling on House Speaker Cameron Sexton to resign as Speaker of the House. He is an enemy of democracy and the people have spoken. They try to crucify democracy, but you see here a resurrection of a movement, a multiracial movement for democracy happening in Tennessee. This is all choreographed progressivism, stunts as usual, no substance. With me now is Tennessee State Representative Dr. Sabi Kumar. Now, I want to play the audience a moment from the man Justin Jones when he was addressing you, sir, last week. What I told you was what you just exhibited as the only member of their caucus who is not of the Caucasian persuasion. I said that you put a brown face on white supremacy. So, um, Dr. Kumar, this racist, is their new hero? Sir, can you hear me? Yes. Yeah, I, uh, oh, I can hear you yeah, now. My, my I did question not for to you a moment. Is, yeah. Oh, okay. My question to you is, he basically makes these incendiary comments, which come across to me as racist, and yet he's their new hero? It is unbelievable, isn't it? I have actually verified with many people who do agree and believe that that's a racist remark. And, but these are people who claim to be fighting against racism, and yet for them to practice racism is really uh, a travesty of facts. And uh, this happened during a committee meeting, so I reminded him during his uh, hearing when we were and discussing the motion to expel, that he said that. Well, he doubled down on it, and he repeated it in even a worse manner. Well, my concern is, what happened to staff work or just simple awareness on the part of our national leaders, that they're honoring this person who has made a blatant, outright racist remark on video? What, is it not—are those leaders not aware of it? Obviously not, because I can't imagine that our national leaders will tolerate a remark like that. Maybe it did not get passed to them from their staff. But I, again, it is definitely well, uh, a racist remark that should not be tolerated. Well, yet our vice president swooped in. Here's her comment. I want to start by recognizing the Tennessee Three. They chose to lead and show courage to say that a democracy allows for places where the people's voice will be heard and honored and respected. Dr. Kumar, um, your response to the Vice President of the United States elevating this man? Well, certainly, certainly, taking over and holding hostage a House of Democracy, a House of Representative for the duly elected members, that is not an exercise in democracy. And it's not an exercise of your First Amendment rights to take away the rights of all others. That is not uh, a First Amendment exercise at all. It is remarkable that uh, in one of our committee uh, hearings, I used uh, Vice President Harris as an example of a person who, daughter of immigrants, very fortunate, good education, became an attorney, became an attorney general of California, 
became a senator and is now a vice president. Despite all the blessings that America offered to her parents, who were immigrants, and to herself, her view of America is, again, that America is a racist country. We were discussing divisive concepts, and I think that remark from me is what triggered uh, 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 Representative Jones to yeah. say what he did. That was his oh, response. Yeah. You, to you it. said him. You triggered him. Yeah, State Representative yeah. Kumar, thank you. You triggered him, clearly. We appreciate it.